One of our top priorities must be to defend parents' rights. You see what's going on. No teacher should ever be allowed to teach transgender to our children without, without parental consent. Those days will soon be over. We will save our kids, and we will also keep men out of women's sports. Is that okay, right? Man. I feel so sorry. The women, you know, they have uh, — they had a record, a swimming record. You know this. A record that lasted for 11 years. And yet one really great woman swimmer, a young woman who wanted to break it. She's a top star. And she thought she could break it by one-eighth of a second. She's got to do it. And then this dude came in, and he swam. He broke the record by 38 seconds, right? 38. In fact, she said she was almost injured. She got injured by the wind of him going by her in the pool. The wind. She got wind burn. But the best of the weightlifting records, those are the ones I like. This woman, I think it was 208, but whatever it was. And she was great. Strong. Strong. I wouldn't want to mess with her. She was strong. And, you know, they take like a half an ounce and they put it on the ends. She's going, ah. I think it was an 18-year record or some ridiculous time. Ah. <laughs> Didn't make it. This guy comes along. Pink. One inch. She, could have stood there all day. I think he broke it by, was it over 100 pounds or something like that? So they were going for one-eighth. I think they put an eighth of a, that's right, they ordered, they, they added a quarter of an ounce to the, to the barbells, and she couldn't quite make it. She'll make it someday. Problem is, they're going to have a hard time breaking these new records, because these new records, I'll tell you what, I hate to say this to women, and I don't want to disrespect you, and it's a horrible thing, and the fake news will say, what a horrible thing. Look, they're all standing there. Oh, finally, we're waiting. They're waiting for a tidbit. But if I were a basketball coach, I would have five men on my team, I swear to you, because I want to win. I'll get the toughest, tallest, strongest men in history that want to go into the women's sphere, and I will have the greatest basketball team in the history of our world. I'll say to LeBron James, who I don't like very much, I'll say, LeBron, did you ever have thoughts of going woman? Because if you did, I'd like to have you on my basketball team. It's true. It's true. Okay, let's get on with it. In addition, we get critical race theory out of our schools, out of our military, and out of every part of our federal, state, and local governments.